Now, the military games uh, holding in Abuja has been a huge success so far, with Nigeria doing well in many of the games. Our correspondent Jane Wizer reports that the Chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Musa, is happy that many African countries took part in the games. The military athletes are thrilled to be part of the ongoing African military games in the federal capital territory. There have been some hilarious, exciting and proud moments for the participants. It's a good idea, of course, and it's uh, my pleasure to meet like uh, officers and uh, other people. And uh, I've met a lot of friends, to be honest. I've met them from other countries, like especially from Nigeria. They are so nice, they are so gentle and kind. I'm very happy. Is uh, take uh, God's medal in Tripsu uh, for my country. It make me to feel good as a, as a shooter. Because um, it's not every all military personnel that know how to shoot, so it's a way of, of uh, standing out among others. I'm so so excited. I'm so happy because we all related well during the competition. So they they, they are so nice. They are nice people. The games have provided a platform for them to showcase their skills and also strengthen military cooperation and partnership. Um, we all know that Nigerians we have a lot of talents, and we have such talents in the military, so why not? Uh, you know, before now, the military and the police and some other uh, military organizations are the ones that actually develop some of the sportsmen for the country. The event has also sparked calls for the military to recruit professional athletes, and I get the Chief of Defense staff hinted earlier in an interview. And one thing I got to understand from them that uh, they are elite athletes, they are national athletes, they are international athletes, like they are enrolled in the military itself. Even in golf and other events, we're working to ensure that we develop that capacity 